10 Largest Oil Tankers in the World From a tanker that weighs more than 200,000 tons and has a maximum load capacity of over 400,000 tons to a tanker that is over 1,000 feet long and that can carry over a million barrels of oil, here are 10 of the largest oil tankers in the world. Eagle Hamilton the Eagle Hamilton is an oil tanker that has been in commission for 12 years since its construction back in 2010. The tanker was built in South Korea at the Sundong shipyard, and she has since sailed under the flag of the UK. In the past three years alone, the Eagle Hamilton has made more than 30 calls to the United States, where more than 2.2 million metric tons have been unloaded across 10 different ports. The oil tanker is 820 feet long, or 249.9 meters, with a width of 144 feet, or 43.8 meters. Eagle Hamilton weighs a total of 62,000 tons has a load capacity of 114,022 tons and is still capable of moving through the water quite easily at speeds of up to 13 knots. This is because of the engines on board which give the ship a combined total of 19,000 horsepower. Beijing Spirit Next up, we have the Beijing Spirit. This crude oil tanker was manufactured in China back in 2010, and it currently sails under the flag of the Bahamas. Owned by the TK Marine Singapore Company, the Beijing Spirit is a part of the largest fleet of crude oil vessels to be owned by a single company. The TK Marine Singapore Company owns a total of 130 vessels, and the Beijing Spirit is easily their most impressive. Weighing in at a total of 83,000 tons, this crude oil tanker has a total load capacity of 156,000 tons. She measures 900 feet or 274.3 meters long and 157 feet wide or 47.8 meters. The Beijing Spirit is powered by engines that give the vessel a total of 25,000 horsepower, which allows it to travel at a maximum speed of 15 knots. Cap Quebec Cap Quebec sails under the Greek flag and was built in 2018 at the Hyundai Samho Heavy Industries shipyard. She was specifically designed as a tanker that is capable of traveling up and down the Suez Canal. As of right now, she is one of only 14 oil tankers that meet this standard, thus placing it in the Suez class of tankers. Cap Quebec is 908 feet or 276.8 meters long by 157 feet or 47.8 meters wide. Thanks to her engines, which produce a total of 21,800 horsepower, Cap Quebec is capable of reaching speeds of up to 14 knots. In total, the ship itself weighs 82,000 tons and has a load capacity equal to 156,000 tons. Saham up next, we have the Saham, an oil tanker owned by the Oman Shipping Company. Saham is one of 16 different tankers owned by this company that are all the same size. These ships measure 1,085 feet long, or 330.7 meters, by 196 feet, or 59.7 meters wide. They are primarily used for shipping oil and other liquefied natural gases, but the company also uses them to ship minerals from port to port as well. Saham weighs a total of 157,000 tons and has a total load capacity of 299,000 tons. It's able to travel the seas, reaching speeds of up to 17 knots thanks to its engines which provide the tanker with a total of 33,000 horsepower. This crude oil tanker was built by the Universal Shipbuilding Corporation in Japan back in 2019 and has since sailed under the Panama flag. Andaman Andaman is a crude oil tanker that sails under the Liberian flag and is currently under the ownership of the Euronav company. This massive tanker was manufactured in South Korea by Hyundai Heavy Industries and was completed in 2016. It has since been used to ship oil and liquefied natural gas to various European and Asian ports all around the globe. Andaman has an impressive length of 1,092 feet or 332.8 meters with a width of 100 196 feet or 59.7 meters. Though you think a ship of this size would be stuck sailing at slow speeds, thanks to the 32,000 horsepower produced by the Andaman's engines, the oil tanker is capable of reaching speeds of up to 14 knots. With the ship itself weighing a total of 154,000 tons, Andaman has a maximum load capacity of 299,000 tons. 
Antigone Antigone is another tanker that is owned by the Euronav company as a part of its massive fleet of 70 ships. It actually shares a lot in common with the previous ship in that both vessels are the same length at 1,092 feet and the same width measuring 196 feet. The total weight of the Antigone is also 154,000 tons, giving the vessel a maximum load capacity of 299,000 tons. The main difference between the two vessels would have to be their engines, with the Antigone being the more powerful tanker. Antigone's engines produce a total of 39,000 horsepower, which allows the massive oil tanker to travel that sea at speeds of up to 15 knots. This tanker was also built by Hyundai Heavy Industries, the world's largest shipbuilding company which is located in South Korea back in 2015 and has since sailed under the Greek flag. Winson number 5 Next, we have the Winson No. 5, which is not only one of the largest oil tankers in the world, but oddly enough, it's also one of the more environmentally conscious. The Winson No. 5 was designed with a double hull style structure, which was created to prevent what they are carrying from leaking and contaminating the environment. How cool is that? This impressive tanker measures a length of 1,095 feet or 333.7 meters with a width of 196 feet or 59.7 meters. Weighing in at a total of 163,000 tons, Winson No. 5 is able to carry a maximum load capacity of up to 312,000 tons, which is equal to roughly 2.2 million barrels containing crude oil. Thanks to its super-efficient engines which provide the ship with a combined horse power of 42,000, the tanker is able to travel at speed of up to 15 knots. Winson No. 5 was built in the Daewoo shipyard in South Korea more than 20 years ago in 2001 and currently sails under the flag of Panama. Sea Emerald Sailing under the Greek flag, Sea Emerald is owned by the Pantheon Tankers Company and since its construction in 2019 has helped to increase the company's transport capacity. So much so that Pantheon plans on adding more ships of similar size and standard as the Sea Emerald to their fleet as soon as the ships are ready. This crude oil tanker was built by the Daewoo Shipyard in 2019 and weighs a total of 156,000 tons. With a 300,000 ton load capacity, this ship proves to be one of the most efficient of its kind. It has room for up to 120,000 cubic yards of fuel in its tank, and thanks to its 44,000 horsepower from the ship's engines, Sea Emerald can reach impressive speeds of up to 17 knots. Sea Emerald is currently the third largest oil tanker in the world, measuring a length of 1,102 feet or 335.8 meters and a width of 196 feet or 59.7 meters. HMM Universal Leader Universal Leader was built by the Daewoo Shipyard in 2019 and is currently one of the five tankers like it that are all owned by Hyundai Merchant Marine. Sailing under the Panama flag, HMM Universal Leader is typically tasked with transporting oil and other liquefied gases on routes going from Asia to America while making stops along the way at ports across Africa and Europe. Measuring in at a length of 1,102 feet or 335.8 meters and a width of 196 feet or 59.7 meters, the Universal Leader is the second largest oil tanker in the world. This massive ship weighs a total of 156,000 tons and has a maximum load capacity of 300,000 tons. The engines on board the vessel produce a combined total of 32,800 horsepower, allowing her to sail at speeds of up to 14 knots. Universal Leader was the first of five ships to be commissioned as a part of a deal that was worth 470 billion South Korean won, or 420 million dollars. TI Europe TI Europe is a massive crude oil tanker that measures an impressive length of 1,246 feet or 379.7 meters with a width of 223 feet or 67.9 meters. Being the largest tanker in the world, it should come as no surprise that TI Europe has the ability to transport 126 million gallons of oil in one trip with a maximum load capacity of 441,000 tons. 
tons. That's the equivalent of 3 million barrels of crude oil. In total, the ship itself weighs 234,000 tons, and though you would think that means it moves slowly in the water, that's actually not the case. TI Europe has engines that provide the ship with an insane 500,000 horsepower and allow it to travel at speeds of up to 16 knots. This massive tanker sails under the Belgian flag and was manufactured by the Daewoo Shipyard in South Korea and has been in operation since 2002. As of right now, there are only four ships on the water like this one, all of which fall under the TI class of Super Tanker, which is in reference to the VLCC tanker pool operator known as Tankers International.